Despegue, Take Off, curso de inglés para principiantes por Juan A. Blackboard. Lección 14, Lesson 14, Part 1. Listen. Is Mr. Levi reading the newspaper now? Yes, he's reading it now. Are Esther and Ruth working at the restaurant? Yes, they're working at the restaurant. Are you studying German? Yes, I am. I study it at the university. Is your boss taking a vacation in Canada? No, he isn't. He's in Argentina now. Aren't your parents listening to the radio? No, they aren't. They're watching TV. Is your girlfriend swimming at the beach? No, she isn't. She doesn't know how to swim. What are the students doing in class right now? They're learning a new tense. Where is your aunt going shopping? She's going to the supermarket. What is your brother fixing your car? He's fixing it today. Who's teaching this class? Miss Berta is teaching it. My little sister is doing her homework now. She does it every day. Dr. Spencer is waiting for you at his office. He's always ready to see his patients. Listen and repeat. Is Mr. Levi reading the newspaper now? Yes, he's reading it now. Are Esther and Ruth working at a restaurant? Yes, they're working at a restaurant. Are you studying German? Yes, I am. I study it at the university. Is your boss taking a vacation in Canada? No, he isn't. He's in Argentina now. Are your parents listening to the radio? No, they aren't. They're watching TV. Is your girlfriend swimming at the beach? No, she isn't. She doesn't know how to swim. What are the students doing in class right now? They're learning a new tense. Where's your aunt going shopping? She's going to the supermarket. When is your brother fixing your car? He's fixing it today. Who's teaching this class? Miss Bertha is teaching it. My little sister is doing her homework now. She does it every day. Dr. Spencer is waiting for you at the office. He's always ready to see his patients. Veamos la construcción del presente de momento. Estructura. Aprendimos en lecciones pasadas el uso del verbo to be y de otros verbos en presente simple. Algunos autores también le llaman presente de costumbre. Ahora vamos a repasar el tiempo presente de momento. Verdadero presente, presente con in, presente progresivo, según le llamen otros. La construcción del verbo se compone de dos palabras. Siempre el verbo to be, que es variable, como auxiliar. Y el verbo principal, invariable. El verbo auxiliar es siempre en su forma de am, are e is. El verbo principal es cualquier otro verbo en su forma simple y agregándole la partícula ing al final. En caso de que el verbo termine en e muda, esta se anula y se le agrega ing. Se dice que este verbo con esta terminación, que son el gerundio, equivalente a las terminaciones ando y endo del español jugando, corriendo, trabajando, etc. Revise las siguientes estructuras. Are you working in the United States? Auxiliar, sujeto, verbo, complemento. No, I'm not working in the United States. Mr. Olsen is working in Mexico now. Sujeto, auxiliar, verbo, complemento. Considere que en presente simple se usan los adverbios o expresiones de frecuencia o de tiempo que indican que la acción sucede con regularidad o que es una verdad general, mientras que en el presente de un momento se usan expresiones de tiempo como now, right now, today, this week, this month, this year. Ejercicios Cambie las siguientes oraciones a preguntas, primero con pregunta afirmativa y luego negativa. Después, contéstelas con oraciones completas usando pronombres y contracciones. Por último, de respuestas afirmativas y negativas cortas. Ejemplo, My boss and his secretary are eating lunch now. Are your boss and his secretary eating lunch now? Are your boss and his secretary eating lunch now? Yes, they're eating it now. No, they aren't eating it now. Yes, they are. No, they aren't. I'm writing a novel. You're studying French with my sister. John is working for a Canadian company. Esther is cooking some sandwiches. The cat is playing with the ball. My little sister and I are doing the homework together. You and your father are having dinner with my family. 
Mr. and Mrs. Wilson are taking a trip to the Bahamas. You're repeating these sentences after the teacher. Carl is playing soccer in high school. The brown bass is going to the university. You and I are reading the same book. Your father and mother are listening music on the radio. The students are making a lot of noise. Part two. Listen, you're repeating the lesson right now, aren't you? Yes, I'm repeating it aloud. Mr. Wilson is living in Houston, isn't he? Yes, he's living with his family. You are learning these sentences well, aren't you? Yes, I'm repeating them several times. Your lawyer isn't representing you this time, is he? No, he isn't. He's very busy. Your brother-in-law isn't taking your sister to the dance, is he? No, he isn't. They prefer to go to the movies. Your business partner's secretary isn't writing those letters, is she? No, she isn't writing them. She's fixing a cup of coffee. European cars cost a lot of money, don't they? Yes, they do. My boss has a French sport car. The Contes have a house in the country, don't they? Yes, they have one. They go there once a month. That blue bus goes downtown, doesn't it? Yes, it does. You have to pay 50 cents. Children don't like vegetables very much, do they? No, they don't. They prefer candy and cookies. Your father doesn't have breakfast at home, does he? No, he doesn't. He always has it downtown. Mr. and Mrs. Collins don't go out on Sunday, do they? No, they don't like to go out on Sunday. Listen and repeat. You're repeating the lesson right now, aren't you? Yes, I'm repeating it aloud. Mr. Wilson is living in Houston, isn't he? Yes, he's living with his family. You are learning this sentence as well, aren't you? Yes, I'm repeating them several times. Your lawyer isn't representing you this time, is he? No, he isn't. He's very busy. Your brother-in-law isn't taking your sister to the dance, is he? No, he isn't. They prefer to go to the movies. Your business partner's secretary isn't writing those letters, is she? No, she isn't writing them. She's fixing a cup of coffee. European cars cost a lot of money, don't they? Yes, they do. My boss has a French sport car. The Hortus have a house in the country, don't they? Yes, they have one. They go there once a month. That blue bus goes downtown, doesn't it? Yes, it does. You have to pay 50 cents. Children don't like vegetables very much, do they? No, they don't. They prefer candy and cookies. Your father doesn't have breakfast at home, does he? No, he doesn't. He always has it downtown. Mr. and Mrs. Collins don't go out on Sunday, do they? But they don't like to go out on Sunday. Veamos la construcción de estas preguntas y respuestas. Estructura. Estudiemos la siguiente estructura para usarse en preguntas con interrogación anexa. Es el equivalente en español de preguntas que terminan con ¿Es verdad? o ¿No es verdad? Your sister is a very pretty girl, isn't she? Yes, she's a very pretty girl. Your uncle and your brother are fixing your father's car, aren't they? Yes, they're fixing it. Jenny looks very nice on jeans, doesn't she? Yes, she looks very nice on jeans. Your brothers don't play football, do they? No, they don't. They prefer to play baseball. Nótese que la pregunta afirmativa termina siempre con un auxiliar negativo y se contesta afirmativamente. Se supone que el interlocutor espera o conoce la respuesta afirmativa. Mientras que la oración negativa termina con una expresión afirmativa y se contesta en negativo. Ejercicios. Cambie las siguientes oraciones a preguntas agregándoles el equivalente de ¿Es verdad? Luego contéstelas con respuestas completas usando pronombres y contracciones. Y por último, de respuestas cortas. Ejemplos. Miss Reynolds is an English teacher. Miss Reynolds is an English teacher. Isn't she? Yes, she's one. Yes, she is. Miss Reynolds isn't an English teacher. Is he? No, she isn't one. No, she isn't. Mr. Scott is working for the university this year. Mr. Cat is working for the university this year, isn't he? Yes, he's working for the university this year. Yes, he is. Mr. Scott isn't working for the university this year, is he? No, he isn't working for the university this year. No, he isn't. Your sister and her boyfriend like to dance very much. Your sister and her boyfriend like to dance very much, don't they? Yes, they like to dance very much. Yes, they do. Your sister and her boyfriend don't like to dance very much, do they? No, they don't like to dance very much. No, they don't. Our teacher always comes to class on time. Our teacher always comes 
to class on time, doesn't he? Yes, he always comes to class on time. Yes, he does. Our teacher doesn't always come to class on time, does he? No, he doesn't always come to class on time. No, he doesn't. Cambi estas oraciones como en los ejemplos anteriores. You're Mary's cousin. Mr. Smith's car is a Ford. Nick and Sally are very good friends. My parents are traveling through Europe this month. Miss Nelson is giving piano lessons. We're doing a large exercise right now. The Clarks have a very big house at the beach. Our cousins go swimming with us next Sunday. The yellow buses charge 25 cents. Margaret likes to go to parties with my brother on weekends. That woman wants a piece of cake and a cup of coffee. Mr. Taylor sells insurance in New York. Fonética. Repasa este cuadro de los 12 sonidos de vocales en inglés. E, easy, eat, 18, these, evening, 15, key, lee, 14th, ring, e, big, bill, bring, building, business, busy, cashier, children, Difficult, interesting. A. April, baby, baseball, day, eight, eighteen, radio, vacation, eighty, eraser. E. American, bed, Betty, breakfast, air, chair, chemist, February, December, dentist. E. Absent, Afternoon, Alice, Bank, Exam, and Example, Answer, at Attractive, or Bob, Biology, Box, Charles, Clock, Concert, Doctor, Father, Heart, Hospital, uh, Drawer, Law, Always, August. Baseball, boss, chalk, ground, daughter, dialogue. O, close, cold, don't, low, four, goes, hello, fourth, October, no. Uh, book, football, good, your, notebook. Woman, who, afternoon, blue, school, shoe, do, institute, June, who, movies, to, a, uh, breakfast, brother, boss, husband, hungry, but, come, comfortable, cousin, does. Uh, afternoon, church, comfortable, concert, Saturday, cover, daughter, thirsty, doctor, early. Vocabulario. About, after, answer, heart, because, call the roll, change, call the party, course, Day before yesterday, exercise, expression, factory, gallery, guitar, holiday, listen, hall, out of town, parade, pay attention, remember, review, sick, stadium, start, tourist, was, was there, where, were there, wonderful, yesterday.